Ladies and gentlemen, I got something here from a channel on YouTube, Gold and Silver, that just broke 100,000 subscribers. One stacker on a journey to find silver. What's up guys, International Stacker back here again, and I got a very special package here from a YouTuber. You all probably know as Silver Dragons, but I'm going to tell you something secret. He started out as Silver Baggins, and the folks from Lord of the Rings that own that sent him a cease and desist, so he had to change his name. Anyways, I was recently on one of his live streams cel celebrating him hitting 100,000 subscribers. Guys, back in the day... That would have never happened for a gold and silver channel. Never. Silver Slacker is one of the highest with about 20,000 subscribers. And since then, it's gone crazy. This community has really grown. If you're new to my channel, please smash the like button. Hit the subscribe button. If it's red, it means you're not subscribed. But when I was on his channel, um, I uh, bid on something. So let's see what I got. And we're going to talk gold. We're going to talk silver. And... 8.5%, guys. I started warning you all over a year ago, a year and a half, two years ago, when it hit 1.4%. Well, it just jumped up 1.4%. Now we're at 85 But that's only the numbers they tell us. It's way worse. It's 15%, 17%, 18 20 Who knows? But I can tell you the metrics and way, the way they measure inflation has changed since the last uh, economic issue. And here's the puppy I bought off Silver Dragons Live. And... He has come such a long way, guys, uh, in terms of pouring silver. This is called the Aztec, and it is three troy ounces. But look at this puppy. 2022. Now, I do, and we're gonna we're gonna weigh this Dragon Gate. Um, I do have some of his first pieces ever um, that he poured. And I have some very old stuff, some old Baggins bars. I have free Baggin, free Baggins bar when he got in trouble. <laughs> I got some old school stuff. I'll bring it out one day. Let's put that on there. Oh. And let's change it to Troy Ounce. And you guys got to make sure you're on Troy Ounce, okay? There we go. And I'm going to have to put this on. There we go. So we're going to zero it out. Yep, over three ounces, 3.015. Wow, that's good quality control, Baggins. But do you guys know about him? And do you guys like poured silver? As you can see here, I do love poured silver. And um, this is probably more extruded than it is poured. But Engelhard, Scottsdale Silver, look at that. Nice little loaf there. Uh, we got some MK bars here. These are both older MK bars. Look at the ripples on that. But look at Baggins, ladies and gentlemen. Look at those ripples. Fantastic stuff. So what do you like to stack the most? Do you like poured silver? Uh, and, you know, I forget the price I got this for. If I remember in editing, I'll put it up on the screen, either here or before I put it up. But do you guys like poured silver? I like poured silver a lot because, one, you can touch it with your hands. Look at this. If you guys liked... Uh, not Lord of the Rings. Um, oh, what was it? Game of Thrones. 5.6 ounces. This is the hand of the king. Would wear that. Um, look at this. One of my friends from Hawaii made this for me, a viewer. Just another average stacker made this. So port silver is very, very cool. Look at this. Silver Spartan. But yeah, it's customizable. You can touch it with your hands. You don't have to worry about it. Just epic stuff. Look at this. This is from Monarch Precious Metals. I love this stuff. I don't know, guys. It's a disease. And I caught the silver, um, poured silver bug from Silver Slacker. That was his thing. A lot of his stuff was poured silver. But it's just such cool. Oh, that's Monarch right there. But what do you guys think? Is this a huge win? I think it's pretty sweet. It's the first piece I've bought off Dragons in a while. Um, you know, I wanted to bid on it, support the stream. 100,000 viewers. 
I am right now, I believe, at 28,000, like 500 and something viewers. So our next goal, guys, is to break 30,000 viewers. I know you can help me do it. And how do you help me? Leaving a comment for the algo, hitting the like, hitting the subscribe if you're not subbed, sharing videos with your friends. I have a bunch more content I'm about to come out with. Uh, I know the past month or two, I've slowed down a little bit, but that's because my uh, profession, you know, work in emergency management, for those of you who don't know, and I've been extremely busy, uh, but going to be coming out with a ton of content. And look at this, guys. You can hold this in your hand, and this could literally buy you groceries in some parts of the world for a month, two months, three months. And look at this. This is a bunch of Viet Vietnam dong. It's called dong. <laughs> Um, but look at that, worth absolutely nothing inflation. Look at this, Lebanon. These are 1,000 lira notes, worth absolutely nothing. Look at these. Zimbabwe. Or actually, yeah, Zimbabwe. Five billion dollar notes, what are here? Look at that. One million dollars. You kidding me, guys? It is just insane. What do you guys think is going to happen? You think we're going to get out of this? You think we're going to get someone in office and save us? You think we're screwed? Are we going to end up with a bunch of funny money just like this? Most of these are bolivars from Venezuela. What do you guys think is going to happen? Is this Venezuela? Yeah, look at that. That's a nice one. What's your prediction, ladies and gentlemen? What's going to happen to us? Yeah, that's Venezuelan. It's cool stuff, but what does it teach us? What does this big pile of paper teach us? It teaches us that at the end of the day, this is just paper. And unless it's actual physical gold... Look at this, poured gold from MK Bars. I stamped this myself, it's on video. Or silver, that's the way to protect ourselves. Or, gold backs. <laughs> I don't know guys, what I do know is, I'm gonna keep stacking. Big plug right now for emergency food, preparewithis.com, you guys, it's on sale. Supply chain's crazy. Don't be a statistic. I guarantee the price on this stuff is going up and not the too distant future. Do not miss that opportunity. I warned you before beer flu. A lot of people got it. A lot of people got left behind. Don't miss it again. And side note, I just want to show you this. Uh, oh, that's not it. This gold coin. This is from an African kingdom back in the day. That's Arabic. Look at that. I want to say it's like a baddest or something. I forget. Then we got some Saudi gold reals here. Look at that. One real. That's the Hedra calendar. V, I believe, is eight. Is that eight? Three, one. I think this is 1388. Wait, five is a circle. Six. And then seven, eight, that might be seven. That might be 1377, 1388. I don't remember. I don't remember. It's been too long. What else we got in here? But what are you guys stacking more right now? Gold or silver? I want to know. Big shout out to Silver Dragons. If you don't know who he is, go sub him up. Great guy. Um, I remember talking to him when he just started. Him and Yankee started around the same time. I'm really happy for Silver Dragons that he's doing so well. And look at this new sticker. Very cool. All right, guys. Well, I hope you liked the video. Um, I'm going to go out there and get me some more gold and silver. And I guess I'll say, catch you on the next one. Woo! One stacker on a journey.